Hey everybody, Jerry from Android Central here, and I want to take a few minutes and show you the new feature in Lookout. They gave us an early build to play with so we could write about it and get you guys ready for it. It's called Safe Browsing. Uh, it's part of the premium package, and I'll let you read and you know see what that's going to cost you, let you make your own decision. I'm only showing you how it works. Uh, first off, it's, it's easy to set up if you open the Lookout app. And we went over all this before. I'll have links that you can go through. I want to keep this a little short and sweet. But if you go into the settings, uh, you'll see a new one there. It says safe browsing. It's either enabled or it's disabled. You know, check means it's enabled. It's easy. It's simple. You know, we like easy and simple. A lot of you guys do too. Go out of here and to show you what it does, uh, let me go into my Gmail. I have here a phishing website. Yes, you can see the URL. No, you should not go there. It's a fake PayPal site. It's gonna to try to steal your PayPal credentials. Let's go ahead and tap it. And boom, right off the bat. You can see it's kinda of loaded in the background, but look out a pop-up just like you would see on Chrome. You are visiting a site that may not be safe. We recommend that you do not visit this page. Uh, you're allowed to if you want. I mean, they're not gonna stop you. You can proceed anyway, or you can block. Uh, like I said, I know what this site does, so I'm going to back out of here. But, you know, false positives happen. And you can see it just took me to a blank page. So if you visit a site that, you know, we've all seen them in Chrome that really aren't phishing sites, but they appear to be, you still have that option to go forward. Uh, yeah, this is not something we like to talk about, uh, but it's a problem. I mean, phishing, website phishing is a problem no matter what platform you're on, even, you know, PC. Everybody says how safe Linux and stuff is. Website phishing happens. Uh, Lookout's trying to put a stop to it. You can manage this however you want. You can do it yourself or you can depend on another app to do it. Uh, I'm just showing you how Lookout does it. It's part of one of their new services. I'll let you guys think about it. Read the blog post. We talk a little bit more about it and I will alright you all later.